Welcome to GT Musketeer again. This is Drew and today we're going to cook hasa curry. I know these guys need to be all kinds. These people love hasa curry. Look at the hasa. Look how they are so big. I just wash them nice and clean and ready to cook. This is all our ingredients, what we're going to use. We have nice fresh chopped tomato, um, jalapeno pepper, onions, some fresh garlic with some crushed pepper, some sweet pepper. Yeah, and here is all our spices. We have um, turmeric, curry powder, jeera, masala, chili powder, curry leaf, crushed pepper, um, some other little season seasoning and you know you guys have that in your kitchen so I just put a little bit of everything you know this is my first thing I usually do with my food I fry some of the jiro there and then we can put our onions to fry there you go the oil is super hot super hot guys with onion so the onion have to come alive you will give him Give it a turn here. These start to get brown. So there we go. And then we're going to throw the um, olive pepper. Olive pepper in here. There we go. See? Looks so good. We just turn up the heat back. That it was, the oil was hot. Too hot. So we go like this. Get brown. Hasa curry. Hasa curry is one is like what everybody favorite food. You know, they love pasta. It's a very hard thing to find. It's very expensive, but in Florida, we go catch it. So we had some in the freezer, but this for this year, through the pandemic, we didn't get any fishing. So we had this and I take a pack. So we decided to cook pasta today. We had a storm earlier, but it is up now. So, and here we go. Throw all the tomato and everything in here now. So this is here. There we go, look. It's got to fry. Pass the curry. Looks so good. It smells amazing. Smells so good. So we go wait let this tomato get a little soft, right? So you can get some color. Okay guys, look. All the um the dry ingredients, all the pepper and all the um caramelized so nice and now we got to dump everything in here we got to dump dump all our spices guys look at the color the color is so nice very rich color you see I always use all the bright color season like chili pepper that that chili pepper gives so much nice bright color look there you go we turn about the heat this slowly it was too hot so there you go. Now we're going to throw in our grind seasoning. In here we have onion, um, green seasoning. Greens are like cilantro, broad thyme, fine thyme, um, some marman folk, um, basil, the green one, the purple one, all of that's blend up and shallow. So we're going to dump this inside here now. See? It looks so good already. Not so good. When I cook my hasa curry, you guys don't want to stop eat. You just eat and eat and eat. Like when I eat my hasa, I have two big hasa in my bit with little rice. I just love it. Yeah, look at that. So we allow this um bunjal. Bunjal good now. And then we're gonna throw our hasa inside. And then we're gonna add coconut milk. Coconut milk, that's the one that gives the nice taste. The thick in the gravy and yam the taste like when it's soaking the hot it's so good okay we go add some salt in here make sure the salt i don't want too much because we don't use too much salt you put over the shoulder remember for good luck and i also like to add one pinch of sugar and always all my food i just put a little pinch of sugar you know it make everybody have sweet words in their mouth <laughs> Like the old people said, just add some little sugar. You have sweet words in your mouth when they eat the food. So that's why I add a pinch of sugar in all my food. So there you go. So this is Punjal good now. Look, we just add our hasa one. We just slow the heat for that. Two. Look at this one, guys. 
so big. Look at all the big one at the bottom. Here we go. Last night we had a storm. We had a storm, a tropical storm named Eta. Oh my God, it was crazy. The wind was like 40 to 50 miles per hour. It was so much rainy. Look at our Hassa, guys. Look, oh my God. He looks so good. I just want to turn this one on the side so the belly could cook. So I go use my hands. Oh no, yeah. To turn it. It's so big, it wouldn't move, man. Oh, there you go. So, there it is. So now, we got to cover it and give them some fire. Hey guys, well now it's ready for the coconut milk. See, we're gonna throw this coconut milk inside now. We don't want to turn it because um, it gets a little nice and brown at the bottom. So we're gonna throw the coconut milk. Throw the coconut milk. Looks so good. Look at the oil. Look at the color, guys. Look. You see, it's not like curry powder too much curry powder it's like more other spices call it like the chili powder the paprika the um the season seasoning and all those bright color spices so now we're going to slice up tomato inside because i get a lot of tomato tomato is good for fish you get good the sourish taste see there you go all the tomato and then we can cover it okay we cover it let it cook now and then we will show you what it look like when it finish so our hasa it was cooking for 10 minutes so we gonna we cook for another 20 minutes 10 minutes i guess and then we can know if it's finished cooking i gotta just just I usually test it like this if the um scale come off faster well then i know it's done so that's the way I know it's fully cooked. So here we go, like 10 minutes. We'll give them another 10 minutes and we'll be done. It's done. This is the last bubble. Last bubble. It looks so soft. Look, look. Take a peek in here. See? <laughs> you could shell out so fast. It looks so delicious. Look at the gravy. Look, it's not too thin. It's not too thick. Hi guys, look at the end. I put some of the leek, the green leek inside the arm. Um, leek is like the family for shallots, so look. It looks so good. So this is the end of our cooking, our hasa curry. So now our hasa curry is done, look. We take the biggest hasa that was in the kahari, look. I'm gonna eat this big hasa. And we cook it with roti because we eat rice for lunch. So we eat this for dinner, roti. So now we're going to taste the gravy and the roti for us. Look, you go. Look, okay, look, there we go. Your dog is good. You soak a bit. There we go, look. Wow. <laughs> go on, Terry. Oh my god, guys. Terry, you want to try this? Look. Yes, let's give this a try. Oh my god, Terry. Grab that. Alright, look. Oh my god, this is so good. I'm gonna rub it on here. That is so good. That is so good. Oh my god. Mm, How is it? Mmm, delicious. Mm. That's good. Okay, let's just taste the hassle. Oh my goodness. Okay, let's taste the hassle. Let me just take out this. It's still hot. I thought it cold already, but. And really? sometimes later on after the, the um the camera I'm gonna take all this in my mouth. And sometimes there's like half the egg in there. Oh yes. Alright guys, thank you so much for watching another video. This was our hasa curry and roti. Remember to remember to like our video, share our video, and subscribe so you wouldn't miss another video. And remember, always love everyone and serve all. Alright, and remember to check out our Instagram page. It is called GT Musketeers um, on Instagram and it's in the description box. And I will continue eating.